Follow-up tonight to a suspected bank robbery we first told you about in Stockton on Monday. The family of the man who was shot inside the Bank of the West says he was not a robber. Police say the man was unarmed when he was shot and killed by an armored truck guard, but he, they claim that he was still posing a threat at the time. And today, the family held a funeral service and talked to KCRA3's Rich I. Barron, who brings us that story. You know what, I'm, at this point, you were just in mourning, we were in shock. The brother of Asif Ajmal is in disbelief, as are others in the family. Ajmal was shot by an armored truck guard inside Bank of the West at Stockton's Weberstown Mall on Monday. My brother was a very sweet person, very gentle person. He would never hurt anybody. While police are investigating the shooting as a bank robbery. He made demands, verbal demands for money from at least... Uh, two, possibly three bank employees uh, before he turned his attention to uh, the armed guard messenger. Police say when Ajmal approached the guard, who had a satchel in his hand, the shooting followed. He was uh, verbally assaultive towards the guard, that he was very aggressive towards the guard, uh, and after repeated uh, demands by the guard for, for him to stay back, he continued to advance on the guard. He had to there was not one bad, like, single cell in this guy's body. He was a really good person. The honest man. Police confirm Ajbal did not have a weapon. The family said Ajbal came from a prosperous family and had no need to rob the bank, which is where he had an account. A married man was you know, expecting a child on the way would not would do not do that, especially with family, brothers, sisters, friends, loved ones with so much family support. There's no reason why to do something like that. Ajbal's pregnant wife was outside of the car waiting for him. For the family and the community, there are many unanswered questions, but the bank surveillance video might answer a few. In stock, Rich Ibera, KCRA, three reports. Now, the surveillance video from the incident has not been released, and the investigation is ongoing. Ew.